Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to start using host bail for beginners in 2024. So first of all, host bail is a powerful automation and billing platform for your online business or for your online store. So make sure to stick by and follow this step by step guide and let's dive right into this video and simply let's get started before we start with this video make sure to watch us from now till the end so you have full experience first you'll need to go and open a browser for me here i'm using brave for you you can use whatever you want so make sure to go and visit host bell go to the url section just type host bell and hit the enter button once you do so make sure to click on the first link make sure it's not a sponsor or something like that and this should take you into their home screen or main screen websites right away. Of course, if you don't know nothing about us, you can simply just read the information here in the home screen. Like as you can see, software for web hosting industry, all-in-one hosting command center. You'll be able to get hosting automation, client management, help desk system automation, or automated billing, then domain management. If you scroll down, like that, how a host bill can help you. So it will help you acquire customers, automate billing, and hosting automation and customer service. More details you can see. If you click on it, it will appear here. You can click on learn more. So basically, for acquired customers, they will provide for you some multi-language option, multi-currency option and easy to customize as you can see automates billing they will give you, give you like recurring billing flexible billing models and automatic reminders for hosting automation they will give you automated provisioning suspended and suspended and terminate and custom automation rules and for customer service single pane of glass server management team oriented communication and multi-channel support so if you want to get started you'll be able to start get started for free but you will get just a 30 days uh, of free, of course. Uh, you get, of course, three, uh, 30 days like money back guarantee if you want to. Of course, if you care like about the pricing and plans uh, or if you want to know about this example, this is it. They have the startup plan, which is $600 one time. As you can see, enterprise is $1,000 one time. Data center, $1,600 one time. And all ex in exclusive, as an example, is going to be $6,000 one time. So. If you're looking for long term like a uh, shop and if you're committed to this as an example if you're not new uh, if you are just a new of course i don't suggest you start like with this right away you can go and start with a lot of other options that you have you have like uh, known options like e-pages able commerce as example uh, i don't know like presta shop uh, foxy cards concrete as an example cs cards virtual mart joomla there's a lot of other uh, options that will help you out just starting out and test things out and see if it's, go if it's working well of course a lot of those options that I mentioned, uh, having some paid plans, but they offer you some demos, for example, to try things out, uh, some uh, 30 days free plan before start paying, and even some of them offer a pre free plan if you want. So you can start with them and test things out, see if your shop is working as intended, and etc. And if you see that you are good to go, you can simply just come here and pay that huge amount of money. As you can see, it's a huge amount because it's one time. It's not a monthly subscription. You don't have to keep paying like uh, every month and etc. So you don't have to worry about that. So that's actually good if you're looking for something long term. But if you're looking for something just short term, as an example, I don't suggest you to go with this one time. Just go with something with monthly as an example. Maybe you will drop after one month or something like that. So as you can see, the features that comes with each plan for this one comes with uh, some cost host bill features, 10 support cases and some integrations, for example, all those integrations here. For this one, it will get everything in here plus 15 support cases and those integrations plus this app. For this one, everything in here as an example and enterprise plus 20 support cases plus those integrations and those apps. And for this all exclusive, it will come with everything in the data center plus 100 support cases, integrations all available included and apps all available included and you'll get all paid client portals included all paid orders pages included and additional license for testing so example check whatever suits you and you can simply just go with it so for me i'll just go here to go, click on get started at the top right corner to start going with that so as example once i click on get started they take me to the same page so as example i'll just go here to show you that they will take me to the same page as example if i click on get started as you can see i'll be taken here so you can just go in that and as you can see if you are not sure which package fits you the most you can simply see full compare uh, region as example it gives you like more details about what is is and what is it is in here what is it in here 
and as you can see a lot of stuff that you be able to check from here but uh, if you're still not sure of course you can simply just contact them as example so let me just go uh, they have an option like here where is this so okay of course they have here some add-ons if you want to add it just some access updates one support tickets 50 support tickets and cdk access as an example and just some add-ons if you want to add it and as you can see this still has paid by by year but all of the other options is just a month once that you will be able to pay so an example i'll just go back to get started here if i scroll down yeah as you can see so you will be able to get in touch if you're still not sure with which option you should go with as an example just fill up your information your message and etc check this minus our robots send them a message and they'll get in touch to you to uh, suggest you uh, like they'll ask you some questions and suggest you the best plan that will suit your needs so for example for me i'll just go here and click on order now this one once i click on it as an example they'll basically take me to another page here you'll basically have to see like how's gonna how you're going to pay of course you can use a promotional code if you have one Maybe if you have like extensions like Honey or something like that, could help you out. I'm not very sure of that because this is not like a very, a very popular like niche uh, that Honey uh, goes for. And of course, as you can see here, you can choose like uh, the one that you want, uh, the thing that you want for product configuration. We can add some uh, things depending on whatever you want. Example, uh, normally all of them should be free. But if any of them like require something, you should be able to pay it or you should have to pay it. So, for example, once you fill up whatever you want, you can simply just go and click on continue, depending on the product configuration that you want. And here you'll basically have to fill up your information. And of course, you'd like to choose your payments method. Is it a bank slash wire transfer or PayPal, credit card, and e check? Whatever it is. Then fill up your information, then go to checkout, and you'll have to pay your plan. Of course, for me, I did not uh, fill up any information, so they will not get me in there. Once I get in there, I'll be able to start using Hostpill. So let me just check if they have like a demo or something like that uh, to show you how the UI is going to look like. So it's going to be good if we have some demo and access into it. And this does not seem like a demo. So what about this? This example, let me just check. Okay, this is just an article and this is like also an article so they don't provide a demo but as you can see the ui will look something like that so as you can see you'll have access to dashboard orders clients area account support affiliates and everything and you will be able to simply just go through it and uh, basically get used to it and of course you will be able to start like configure your basic settings add clients configure products and the services example set up some payments getaway uh, configure some invoice and billing uh, system some automations if you want to add in some add-ons or apps uh, create some support tickets test your uh, setup and even go in live if everything is working as intended yeah as simple as that so that's gonna be it for me today thank you for watching and i'll catch you in the next video so goodbye